Here are 20 ways to troll your friends in Minecraft. Number 1 is a classic. You can reorganize your friends' chests. The next way to troll your friend is to place a TNT block under a trap chest. Be careful not to open the chest though, as opening it will cause the TNT to explode. Set up the trap you see on the screen. There's two torches, and you can add as much TNT as you want. Then, ask your friend to help you mine the diamonds. Go to the world spawn and place a lever under a tree. Then hook it up to a redstone torch. Place TNT next to the torch. Anyone just joining the game will probably go for that tree. A few blocks under your friend's house, place a hopper clock connected to a monostable circuit. Fill the hopper clock with 5 stacks of items. Then connect the monostable circuit to the door. Your friend will hear the door noise every once in a while, but they'll never know where it's coming from. We all know our friends have furnace arrays. Under a couple of the furnaces though, place some hoppers. Your friend will be so confused. If you have a friend that loves doing redstone, just modify a couple bits of redstone. They're gonna have a fun time figuring out what's wrong. If your friend has a house made out of wood, then you can fill up their house with wooden buttons. If your friend really doesn't like torches and wants them all hidden under like carpets or something, then just grab a bunch of torches and put them all over his lawn. In your friend's house, just bone meal an oak sapling and hope it grows very big. Does your friend have a lot of valuables? What you can do is you can take them and then hide them in a secret chest somewhere. If your friend has a nice new anvil and you don't, just swap anvils. Your friend will never find out. You can fill your friend's house up with string. You can also fill up your friend's house with obsidian. You can chat spam, but be careful when doing this on servers as you might get muted or kicked. Does your friend have a lot of valuables? What you can do is you can take them, and then hide them in a secret chest somewhere. While your friend's not looking, just create an infinite falling sand world. When he accidentally clicks on it, he'll be in a very laggy mess. You can also troll your friend by setting up a command block to infinitely summon slimes. If you summon pigs at every entity repeatedly, then your world will have way too many entities. This will cause your friend to lag a lot, which is great when trolling. The final way to troll your friend is to set up a slash kill at E repeating command block. Be careful though, as this will make your world unplayable. There is no way to break that command block without the use of external programs, such as MC Edit. <laughs>